is it? Please. Me. Me, Mitch. this evening so utterly uncavalier but hello beautiful oh my my what a cold shoulder and what a couth apparel why you haven't even shaved and i forgive you i forgive you for such a relief to see you you stop that pork at you and i had caught in my head did you ever get anything caught in your head of course not you dumb angel but you never get anything awful caught in your head we have to have that fan on no i don't like fans well let's turn it off honey i'm not partial to them uh, I don't know what there is to drink. I haven't investigated. I don't want Stan's liquor. It isn't Stan's. Something's on the premises actually mine. How's your mother? Is your mother well? Why? Well, something's the matter with you tonight. Never mind, I won't cross-examine the witness. I'll just pretend I didn't notice anything different. Is that music again? What music? Look at you and they were playing when they Alan. Wait. There. Sharp. It always stops after that. Yes. Now it stopped. Are you boxed out of your mind? I can find the way. Oh, by the way, forgive me not being dressed. I've practically given you up. Had you forgotten your invitation to sober? I wasn't going to see you anymore. Oh, wait a minute. I can't hear what you're saying. And you talk so seldom when you do say anything. I don't want to miss a single syllable of it. What am I looking for around here? Oh, yes. The liquor. You've had so much excitement. I am bugged out of my mind. Oh, here's something. Southern cheer. What can that be? I wonder. Take your foot off the bed. It has a clean cover on it. Of course, you boys wouldn't notice a thing like that. I've done so much of this place since I've Aren't been you here. leaving here pretty soon now? What? Oh, I wonder this ought to be mixed with something. Mmm, it's sweet. Terribly sweet. Why, well, I believe it's liqueur. Yes, that's what it is, a liqueur. I don't think you'll like it, but try it. Maybe you will. I told you before, I don't want any of his liquor, and I mean it. He says he's been lapping it up all summer like a wildcat. I won't descend to the level of such cheap accusations to answer. In your mind. See something in your eyes. It's dark in here. I like the dark. The dark is comforting to me. I've never seen you in the light. That's a fact. Helga. I've never seen you in the afternoon. I met you at the plant in the afternoon. Not on Sunday afternoon. You never want to go out till after six, and then it's always someplace that's not lighted much. There's some obscure meaning in this, but I failed to catch. What it means is I've never had a real good look at you, Blanche. Let's turn the light on in light, here. Which light? What for? This one here with this paper thing on it. Oh, what did you want to do that for? Just so that I can take a look at you, good and plain. Of course, you don't really mean to be insulting. No, just realistic. I don't want realism. I want magic. Magic. Yes, yes, magic. I try to give that to people. I do misrepresent things. I don't tell truth. I tell what ought to be truth. And if that is sinful, then let me be punished for it. Don't turn the light on. <laughs> I don't mind you being older than what I thought, but... But all the rest... <laughs> Why, that... That pitch about your ideals being so old-fashioned, and, and all the malarkey that you've been dishing out all summer... Oh, oh, I knew you weren't 16 anymore, but I was fool enough to believe you were straight! Who told you I wasn't straight? My loving brother-in-law and you believed him? No! No, I called him a liar at first, and then I checked on the story. I talked directly over long distance to this merchant in oil. Who is this merchant? Keefop. 
The merchant chief Abba Oriel. I know the man. He whistled at me. I put him in his place. And now for revenge, he makes up stories about me. Didn't you stay in a hotel called the Flamingo? Flamingo? No! Tarantula was the name of it. I stayed at a hotel called the Tarantula Arms. Tarantula Arms? Yes, a big spider. That's why I brought my victims. 